Hello there viewers, welcome back to the channel. You've heard about stem cells in the news, and you've probably wondered if they could help you or your loved one with a serious illness. You may wonder what stem cells are, how they are being used to treat diseases and injuries, and why they are the subject of such intense debate. Stem cells are the body's raw material cells from which all other cells with specialized functions are generated, under the right conditions in the body or the laboratory. Stem cells divide to form more cells called virgin cells, and these daughter cells either become new stem cells or specialized cells with more specific functions, such as blood cells, brain cells, heart muscle cells, or bone cells. No other cell in the body has the natural ability to generate new cell types. Stem cell therapy is a form of regenerative medicine designed to repair damaged cells within the body by reducing inflammation and modulating the immune system. This phenomenon makes stem cell therapy a viable treatment option for a variety of medical conditions. Stem cell therapies have been used to treat autoimmune, inflammatory, neurological, orthopedic conditions, and traumatic injuries with studies conducted on use for Crohn's disease, multiple sclerosis, lupus, COPT, Parkinson's, ALS, stroke recovery, and more. The process begins with your doctor removing stem cells from your bone marrow. Bone marrow is usually excised from your hip region. Your doctor will first clean and numb your hip area and then a needle is inserted into a part of your pelvic bone called the iliac crest. Bone marrow is then aspirated using a special syringe, and the sample obtained is sent to the laboratory. The aspirate is spun in a machine for 10 to 15 minutes in the laboratory, and a concentrated stem cell sample is separated. Your doctor then cleans and numbs your affected area to be treated and then injects the stem cells into the diseased region under the guidance of special x-rays. The whole procedure usually takes almost one hour and you may return home on the same day of the procedure. Do you know why stem cell therapy is so popular? Number 1. Treatment of Cardiovascular Diseases Cardiovascular disease can deprive heart tissue of oxygen, resulting in scar tissue, which changes blood pressure or blood flow. According to research, stem cells from the adult bone marrow may differ in the need for vascular and cardiac repair due to the secretion of various growth factors. Number 2. Helps heal incisions and wounds. Studies have shown that stem cell therapy can help grow new healthy skin tissue, increase collagen production, stimulate hair growth after cuts or damage, and replace scar tissue with new improved healthy tissue. Number 3. Autoimmune diseases. Stem cell therapy for autoimmune diseases is a new option for people living with severe and debilitating conditions such as rheumatoid arthritis and lupus. Autoimmune disease occurs when your immune system attacks its tissues, cells, and organs. This therapy is a minimally invasive procedure that seeks to keep downtime to a minimum. Number 4. Orthopedic conditions. This therapy can help those who are experiencing discomfort related to orthopedic conditions, spinal diseases, and sports-related injuries. They address the underlying sources of pain while providing healing effects and the opportunity for long-term relief. The disadvantage of adult stem cell therapy is the lack of data about its long-term effects as it is a newer evolving therapy. As stem cell therapy uses the cells derived from your own body, it reduces the chances of an immune rejection. Stem cell therapy is generally considered a safe procedure with minimal complications. However, as with any medical procedure, complications can occur. Some risk factors related to stem cell therapy include infection. Stem cells can be contaminated with bacteria, viruses, or other pathogens that can cause disease during preparation. The procedure of removing or injecting cells carries a risk of infection in the damaged tissue where they are injected. Rarely, an immune response can occur from injected stem cells. Here we end up for today. Stem cell therapies have been used in the treatment of a variety of medical conditions and have shown significant results in restoring mobility and improving the quality of life. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, hit like, share, and subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to hit the bell icon below.
Thanks for watching.